Swayman's been strong, you might end up with the youngster as your number one goalie. Yeah, Stop well, here. I think he showed last year he can handle high-pressure situations, and this Bruins team defends well, so a great opportunity for the youngster to continue on. Hesman Swiss to line in, in his first game in this building as a flyer. Already a fan favorite, and I think he's going to add to the energy level of the games, uh, Jonesy, because as you... Just out of the reach of Linus Holgerg, who sees his first action. And Tom Bleed to the puck for Boston. Got it front and was stopped. I had a rebound shot. And Hart made the save there as well. Crease area. Charter Hart doing his part to stay strong right there. Bleed with a couple of opportunities. Kuhlman with the second chance. Good stuff play by Bleed. And Kuhlman's there to grab the rebound and kind of slide it around the defender before eventually getting it on net. And the 23-year-old defenseman from Sweden. The puck for it, Nico Baker, powering his way in for the shot, Swayman makes the save. That strength and strong skating ability, powers this past the defender, and gets a good shot on goal, Swayman outweights him, doesn't overreact, just calmly goes about doing his thing, kicks that leg over. Between the benches for CNT is a backhander by Obey Cubell, who's very active early, but Swayman knocks that one down and hangs on as well. Flyer players last year did not take that step forward. There he is again, moving through center. Clifton marking him. The shot! And that one glances. That's off the stick of Swayman and wide. There's Wilman handling that pass nicely. Got it to the blue, but it was checked there. Cates will get it back to the point. Wiley to Yandel. Now Cates a shot. Black second try. Save! Swayman through traffic in front. Wiley will seal him off with the Bruins pick up the puck. Lead getting it back to Moore at the point. His shot glances off hard at the side of the net. Jackson Cates, the pass to Wilman, another good handle there, and the quick shot, fought off by Swayman, he's able to gather the rebound. Bruins moving up here, Carson Kuhlman, a nice move, swoops on in, he's checked it, sits there, rebound shot, save made, as Hart stayed with it. The crowd didn't think it was all good, and now the pass by Denoyer and the shot by Clendenning, batted away by Swayman, Lindblom has it back to Clendenning, but then he quickly in front, tripped up. Another trip not called as Lindbaum has been dumped twice. Actually, that was to know, hey, he was tripped. He now he takes the shot and the save made by Swayman. And Lindbaum right there on the backhand. What a feed. Swayman's Whoa. looking the other way. Wow. And oh, that hits right you. Radium oh. Karam right there. And unintentional. Yep. Karam. Try to take advantage of the fresh sheet of ice. Again, no closure in the lineup tonight. Yeah, so very well in that interview. That one just bounces in on Swayman. I mean, you got a lot going on for this 19-year-old. Uh, not Nico Bakey, but lost the jab at it. But back the other way go the Bruins with some speed. Carson Pullman moving well. Develops into a two-on-one to bleed. Bleed the shot. Glove. Save Hart. And he'll squeeze it. Carter Hart flashing some leather to deny the Bruins. From Ryan Ellis, and here's lead with a shot attempt and right to the glove of Hart. Good positioning by Carter, not a whole back to play in the game. They're happy they got him. An opportunity is a bouncing puck. Atkinson's got it. In and goal! Save Swayman. There will be a penalty, and it's going to be a two minute hooking call. Atkinson says, How about a penalty shot? But breakaway here on that high flipping puck. It's Atkinson that tracks it down again. Little hook right there. That will be the penalty, but Atkinson. Fanned on the first shot, but did get a second crack at it. Second time we've seen Atkinson have a breakaway in the preseason. Second and time he's gotten a second crack at yeah. it, too. Steen, back, and Sean, cross ice, that one deflected, save hard rebound! He knocks that one down, too. Buck was loose, but they blew it dead. That's some traffic in front. Listen to the whistle. As it's swept away by Bunneman. Alco is there, plays the other way. Side of the field up net, Wiley a crack at it! They fired up the post, rebound, they score! Out of a dirty play in front, I think Oscar Steen may have been the last Bruin to touch the puck, we'll wait and see. But it's a power play goal for the Bruins and they have a one nothing lead. The long reach of Studnika is gonna have, end up benefiting him right there as he kind of went over the body of Carter Hart, did not interfere with the Flyers net miner and fires that puck in the net. In the legal fashion, good effort by Studnika, a player that has put on some size and strength in the offseason. Neil Aslan getting that back to the point, lost by Clifton, trying to work around him. Is Van Rijsdijk, he's got it. 
JVR and on goal! Save made by Swayman. But there will be a penalty. Number 65. So two minutes separation for Separation after Clifton had a tough time with the puck. There's this skill of JVR. A little hook right there on the hands. It could have been a penalty shot, but Flyers need to work on their power play right now. They're going to do a shootout after this game, regardless of what the score is. And they can let JVR take one of those. Dropping it back, handle. Takes the shot, deals it across Van Riemsdyk. And he'll just drop it off for Farabee and head to his office. Yandel, a shot! Save made by Swayman. Couture back out in front, ricochets to Yandel. Yandel to Couture for the shot! He scores! Yandel again with a great setup. Couture, the one-time blast this game. Tied at one on the power play goal. The best time. And there's the pass by Yandel right in the wheelhouse. Couture fires it. Kind of a rolling puck that manages to slide around Swayman. Swayman looked like he got a piece of it. I think he did, but not enough. And Couturier's got the goal. And Yandel picks up a helper with a really nice pass. Sold shot. And tonight with uh, Atkinson and Lindwam. Got a few more noticeable. Points. Yes, you you got to produce, right? And that's when the puck settles down as Yandel finds the open man. Couturier across. Thirty the shot and the save. Swayman. And they're able to clear Ferebi. Over off. It's to Ferebi. Back to Ivan and then across. Over off center point. Wrist there. Save Swayman. Rebound. Oh, the save on Konechny. Set up again. Now it's Ferebi turning with it. He'll fire. Oh, fire. Everything but the finish for the Flyers on this power play. Here's Katuria. Really well to his left. Let's see Pat on that. Ferebi shot through traffic. JBR providing the screen. Goes right off the goal post with that shot. Move the puck around up top. Lazar down low. Wagner shot. Save her. Rebound steered wide by Frederick. He had the screen that time. Wasn't looking for a pass. He's looking for the shot. Now put on the other way with a shot. Saved by Hart with a stick. And it sits down in front for him. Most of the play in the Philadelphia end of the ice. Lindblom will cancel the icing here. Centered in front. Frost. He's denied by Swayman. Oh, that would have been huge. The Flyers trying to get... Lindblom in this game. Look at his awareness. He took a peek, second look, and puts it right through the feet of the defenseman, right on the tape of Morgan Frost at an earlier pass in the game as well. That led to a scoring chance and a third one that put Cam Atkinson away to the races on a breakaway attempt. And the Bruins. With one last push instead. Four seconds. Savoro taken down by Handel. And that's it. Third period comes to an end. He has been very impressive. Product of University of Maine. Let's see if the Flyers can get one past him here in the overtime. Gains the line. And now will turn back with it. His pass across the Konechny is knocked down. It ends up going in on goal. Swayman thought about covering up, but keeps the puck in play. Dangerous looking play, wasn't it? Studdika with his stick on the ice, and Marco just missed him with it. Now Couturier is steal, finds Konechny, charging into the Boston zone, Konechny holds the pass to Provorov, he scores! Ivan Provorov wins it for the Flyers, as they beat Swayman and take it 2-1. to one. Straight in the tape for Provorov, Couturier grabs that loose puck in the neutral zone, he sends Konechny on his way, nice little stutter step by Konechny and a pass across. Uh, Provorov is able to snap home. Here's the play by Konechny. Bobbled the puck a little bit, but then really calmly corralled it and saucered a puck over to Provorov there. And he's able to elevate that puck.